So hey guys, so today Dario's not with us, so you don't get your welcome back. <laughs> but welcome back. Um, today we're gonna be doing our first baby haul. Or I'm gonna be doing our first baby haul. Um, and most of the stuff you'll see came from the baby shower. Um, our stuff that we bought with gift cards and money that we got from the baby shower. So if you're watching this and you gave us one of the items that we're about to show, we want to thank you guys so much again for all your support and coming out to celebrate with us on our baby boy. Um, so we're going to start off with the clothes. We didn't get clothes um, at the baby shower because of course nobody knew what it was. Um, but we used the money in the gift cards to buy the clothes and I was so out of element looking at little baby boy clothes. <laughs> So my husband um, picked out a lot of stuff. So you probably remember this shirt from Baby Shower. It's a boy! This little onesie. It's the cutest thing ever since Destiny to be drafted. We also, we went and bought some more onesies. Just so we can have some stuff. We got them in a few different sizes. We got newborn and then zero to three months. I don't know how big this baby's gonna be. Um, we just got a couple of different colors and this came in a three pack right here. Basketball, of course. Y'all didn't know my husband, he played all types of sports in school. So I'm pretty sure he is really excited to get this baby playing some sports. Um, some more sports and then some little space stuff one thing he did not want to get is dinosaurs <laughs> he does not want dinosaurs on the clothes for some reason so if you're watching and you plan on buying baby clothes don't get anything with dinosaurs on it <laughs> this right here is a cute little collar shirt or collar onesie and then some more sports stuff and these are the zero to three months. Hopefully baby fit in this newborn stuff when we bring him home. We got some little shorts. Okay, different color shorts. It's gonna be June when the baby gets here. Um, we tried to find some pajamas. And some little basketball shorts. My husband walks around here all the time. <laughs> We tried to find some pajamas, but unfortunately everything in the store was all long sleeve and um, full length with the legs in. But I did look on um, Children's Place and they have like some short sleeves with little shorts pajamas. So I'm going to probably check them out and get some of those. But we did get some cute little shirts. They actually first went to Babies Are Us. And you can see that footage. You're going to put that footage in there. <laughs> and we found nothing because they only have 10% off still. 10% off. It's probably why they're going out of business because nobody want to buy it because it's only 10% off. So we ended up going, Target and Walmart are like right there in the same vicinity so we just ran to those couple places i had and then a lot of gift cards i got were for target so a lot of stuff came from target i'll show you little outfits we got from there but these little t-shirts like this like came from walmart from target and these are all newborn see this is my little sidekick i picked out this one but he didn't tell me he didn't want anything with dinosaurs on at the time so he didn't even notice it was cute and then another little three-piece outfit Okay, all this stuff right here is Carter's, and right now Carter's actually has a good sale. I get, I don't know if anybody gets updates from Crazy Coupon Lady, but I get updates from her, emails from her, and she, um, they're having a 70% off, and then you can pile 20, an uh, extra 20% off coupon on top of that. So these little three piece sets, like right here, they were $20 at Target, and I think say so you can get them for like $4.24 a piece at Carter's right now. So we're gonna go check out Carter's. And see what they have and then somebody got us this little robe I think my uncle Willie and his wife Jeannie had got us this little robe which is so cute mm, you see it had little ones like that 
And we got some little, some little animal socks that we got from the baby shower. And some more little booties. They were cute, little different colors. And then we got these little pair of shoes that Alicia picked out, actually. And they were really cute for zero to three months. A couple little bibs from the baby shower. This is about, I don't know, they look like they for little boys. So somebody had a feeling it was going to be a little boy. And we went and picked up a few more bibs. I don't know if you can see those. I got them from little mittens because babies tend to scratch their face and stuff. So we got a little pack of mittens for them. It's a little bow tie. And as you can see, it has like some little numbers down here in the corner. It's just brand new right there. What this is, is a milestone set that my aunt and uncle gave us. Um, and so instead of, you know how some people take the pictures with a little one, you know, one every every month. Everybody do something different. You put a little bow tie on them and change the number of the month. So this was really, really cute. If you can see the little baby up there with bow tie. And here's one month, even if you look big in one month. So he also picked up just some little blankets um, right here. These are receiving blankets. And this came three in a pack. Um, Carter's came from Walmart. We got these just so we can have something when he gets home um, to lay out like on the couch or on the bed. And then we got some Swaddle Me blankets. I'm interested to see if he's going to like being swaddled. Because Alicia did not like being swaddled. She did, couldn't stand having her um, hands and arms where she couldn't move them. So we'll see what the baby boy does. <laughs> and then I, got, I just got um, a couple of different types of blankets. I got one. Um, a knit blanket and then a plush blanket. This one's a little bit lighter. Um, so if it's not as cool, then we'll probably wrap them up in this one. And then this one is for, if it's just a little bit cooler, probably when he's in the bassinet at night, we'll wrap them up in this plush blanket. But just some cute little ones. This one right here is like a gender neutral color. Couldn't find anything that was really blue or anything like that. So we just picked out a gray one. Alright, bath stuff. Alicia couldn't use Johnson, Johnson and Johnson. So I put like Baby Dove and Baby Avino on the um, registry. And a couple people got us some of those items off the registry. So we're gonna try that um, with the baby boy. We will, we did still get some Johnson stuff. So we're gonna try it out and see if he has sensitive skin as well. Okay. So just some miscellaneous stuff we got. We got from Baby Shower, um, the baby monitor with the camera. And this is by Motorola. My aunt and uncle got us this. Um, so it has a five inch video baby monitor um, with Wi-Fi internet viewing. Um, and you can view it on your smartphone. So if you don't have this with you, like if I, I guess if I was away, I could view it from home, I'll look it up and see exactly what we can do with it. But this is really nice. We want to use this at the top of our list. I'll leave an Amazon link in the description if anybody wants to check it out and look it up and stuff. Um, my sister hosted the baby shower and one of her gifts, um, she did diaper cakes and she gave us a bunch of diapers and everything. But a lot of her gifts were, she gave us a bunch of different books for the baby, for us to read to the baby. So we got a ton of books. Then we went and picked up this Baby Boy's Big Adventure book. And what it is is basically, we have one of these for Alicia in storage. Um, a memory book for the baby. Alright, so it goes all the way up to the fifth birthday. So it's five years of stuff and it has like my first haircut. You put the pictures in there and lose his first tooth and all those types of pictures. So it'll be a really good book to grow with the baby. Alright. And then next little thing, we got a couple of little pacifiers, the hospital grade kind. Um, <laughs> at least he didn't take pacifiers, so we'll see how well these work with him. And the little pacifier holder thing that keeps them from losing it. Tie it to their little onesie or little shirt. We got him a double pump downstairs. 
Um, but my sister-in-law got us a manual one. And I had one of these with Alicia. It's really convenient for when you're in the car. Um, because it's really hard to take out all that equipment and all the strings and wires and stuff to breast pump when you're in the car to get the baby a bottle. So, if you're going on a long trip, definitely recommend a manual breast pump. And we can put the link in the description for that. Go along with breastfeeding. If you are breastfeeding, you're definitely gonna need some nursing pads to stop you from leaking. <laughs> so, um, my sister-in-law also bought some of these. And these are actually, I think, disposable ones. But they do have ones that you can wash as well. So these are right here, 60 pads and it's medium coverage. Um, but they do have reusable ones that you can throw in the washing machine too. All right, so this looks like a book bag, but it's my breast pump. And it comes with a really nice cooler bag. And you freeze this and stick it in the cooler bag. And it has room enough for four little bottles. But these are just storage bottles. They don't come with the nipple or anything. So they just store your milk and keep it cold for you. So when I go back to work, this will be really convenient for me to have. I think it lasts 12 hours, um, the ice pack does. And then at the very bottom in the front is where the actual pump is. And everything so it's nice and neat in this little backpack so it'll be easy to carry when you have the baby with you and it's really <laughs> subtle so it's not walking around with a big <laughs> something that looks like a big old breast pump just looks like a regular book bag and then since um the pump didn't come with any bottles i bought these um, Phillips Avent bottles and they're supposed to mimic your breast it's supposed to be the most natural way to feed your baby um, and it's just a little starter kit for a newborn it comes with four bottles a cleaner and a pacifier we got this um, my best friend bought us this from the registry and it's a bottle cleaner it's a two tier and hold up to 16 bottles or cups um, and it twirls around which is really nice so you don't have to lift it up or anything like that and it has a little drip tray in it we had one with Alicia so these things have come a long way it does a lot more than that one did and of course you can find the link in the description for this as well we went and picked out a diaper bag we chose this one <laughs> because my husband would probably be carrying a diaper bag most of the time and he wanted something that you know, look a little bit more manly than <laughs> than a regular diaper bag. So it looks like a book bag. It's really nice. It has a little white thing right here. You can take this plastic off. You just stick your wipes in here and you don't have to like dig them out your bag or anything. You just pop this top off and pull the wipes out. And then there's another insulated pocket on this side, which is cool. And I think it has like earbud access. Okay. So when daddy has the baby and he wants to <laughs> keep his earbuds in here. This is the Greco Smart Organizer System is what the bag is called. Um, so if any dads are interested in something like this so it won't look so girly carrying around a, a big diaper bag. Um, it's really cool. It has a lot of compartments in it. Then we got this from a friend at the baby shower. Um... And you know, just one of those little play mats where the baby lays down on his back and pulls the little toys up. And then they have it where you can convert it to just a mat and take the toys down so the baby can get tummy time. So, this was really cute. And we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19 packs of diapers. 12 packs of wipes and a diaper genie. And to go along with the bath stuff, we also got this really nice tub 
um, that you can put in the sink first and it has little support things and then it grows with you so it goes all the way up to over nine months so as you can see in the beginning um it just i guess it just has different layers where you can it has a swing okay yeah here it goes so sit me up support so it has a little swing for a newborn and then it has a little seat when they get old enough to sit up it was a really really nice bathtub all right so that was our very first baby haul with our little boy um as you can see we didn't really have any big items like the stroller and the car seat and anything yet so we might do another video when we get that stuff we'll see we'll have another haul coming for you i mean we'll have another haul coming soon and thanks so much for watching